guys this is what happened like you can see bang you guys can see bang <laughs> yes is this a recording I just brought this guy, they stop, I'm just gonna put it there, that way it doesn't happen again. There you go, and now we're just gonna remove this old fiber tape in here. up a little bit we're not gonna remove all the mud because just uh, would make more mess and uh, we don't really need it and here we have uh, some uh, concrete fill yeah this is uh, we just have concrete fill with some uh, tape mud it is that the thick mud has more glue on it, so it would make it strong. With it would hold better than just the concrete steel. So I'm just gonna try to load this hole before I put the tape on. Make sure we have enough compound in there. Make sure we have some support for the tape. Here we go. This is just a mesh tape, fiber tape. Just gonna put one second one because the hole is a little bit bigger. Would make it stronger. Just gonna load it right now. Just uh, We just let this set and then we come back and scrape it and then we load I would not would, would not load the whole thing because we're gonna do with a finish mud so here's a red mud I just removed the tape put another tape and we stole the door stop in there so it would not happen again I feel this is not much, it's just my like, uh, We put some pocket fill, don't have to leave too much because uh, once we do it the finish mud then we leave some more. Load this guy up, nice and easy. Yeah, we just use the finish compound. We just use this as a finished compound, so it's very soft to sand. Here we're just gonna use a six inch tape knife. And uh, it's good enough, it's very small, we're just gonna leave some mud and that way you don't have to bring all the tools. Just uh, what we're gonna use for this one. Load it. You guys can see a little bit mark in there, but it's, uh, because it's just a small repair, we just send it, doesn't affect much the job. Alright. That's it, next one.